Hey guys, welcome back to Vitamin Y. So today is Wednesday, it means we're using Evox Seas. So another day, another duel. So either we're gonna get some good duels and I'm gonna be happy and we're gonna say GG to each other or I'm gonna be dealing with some nubs. Some nubs, like elbows, nubs. So let's hope it's uh, the first one. You know? I don't mind losing as long as we have a good duel. Alright, oh, well, this hand's not too terrible. Nah, it's not too terrible. I'll go ahead and activate you. I had some interesting plays. I actually drew you, but, you know, that's the one problem with running him. Is that that's just another damn monster that I'm going to have the opportunity of drawing sh shit that I want to draw. So, I'm pretty much going to deplete my whole fucking hand, but it's fine. So, at least I drew Dark Greffer. Like, if I didn't draw Dark Greffer, I'd definitely be searching for Dark Greffer right now, but... That's cool. Yeah. So now I got my level 9 in the graveyard. I'm about to send my level 4. I'm going to send you Bill. I'm going to have my level 10 and I'm ready to go. I'm saying that's why I wish I would get freaking uh, message in a bottle more often. Because I, I can get it set up. Like this deck can get it set up real quick. Like Akashi Kyle took a while. The deck didn't really have much synergy. His other level monsters were lights. And I'm synergy with this. It's this deck. They're dark. They are clearly dark. So, I'm just gonna get nice and set up. I'm gonna drop everybody to the grave. Everybody get in the pool. And just to make sure that I'm not in too much deep shit, I'm definitely gonna make that King of Fire Limp. And that King of Fire Limp is definitely, definitely gonna give me that Mass Chameleon because I might need that next turn, depending on what happens. I'm gonna set one card. He's gonna be like, oh! Oh, I got an MST. Go ahead and MST it. I'm definitely going to chain and summon terror. You know damn sure well I'm going to summon terror. So please, 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 MST it, please. If not, definitely kill my King of Fire Limp. You got to. You you have to take out my King of Fire Limp this turn. I, I will plus, so. That is definitely something that needs to be done on your checklist. Oh, you're not going to kill it? Fine. Mm -mm. Uh -oh. oh, there's Mass Chameleon. All right, so thank you, Mask Chameleon. I will, I mean, thank you for drawing Mask Chameleon. I'm going to search for my third Mask Chameleon. How's that sound? Sounds pretty good? I think it sounds pretty good. I like, I like, I like that. I like that. Uh, I run Scrap Dragon in here. Nope. I run you. I run you. I run you. None of you guys are good right now. None of you. So I guess it's you. I guess it's just uh, start a spark, I guess. Yeah, so... Normal summon. Get your effect. Summon you. Sync eight. I'm so really surprised that I didn't. I, I'm running Spark over Scrap Dragon. I usually run Scrap Dragon, but I don't know for some odd reason. I guess I didn't this time. All right. Usually I lock okay, so Usually I run Scrap Dragon. This usually my go-to card. There's no way you have more than a 23 booty. Okay. Okay. So. He blocked me with his Stardust Strong. I mean, I guess it technically has more than a. To its effect, it had a nice booty. <laughs> Stardust Spark, it's been a... Oh, sure, sure. Yeah, Stardust Spark, it's been interesting. I haven't played Stardust Spark in a cool minute. It's, like I said, it's usually Scrap Dragon or Beals, but Stardust Spark, I wonder why it's in there. I really can't think of a reason why it would be in there over Scrap Dragon. I just I kind of just slapped it in there and forgot Scrap Dragon. Sounds something like... Sounds like something I would do, so... Yeah, at least I opened up pretty well. Hand was pretty well. I totally didn't mind drawing the Mask Millions. I totally do mind drawing you Bell like this, though. I totally mind that. So I guess I'll go ahead and send uh, Level Eater, since can't do anything with this right now. Like, really? Damn it. What's up with me drawing cards that I run at one? Like, come on, please. Please, I need to get that Dark Grapher real quick. I was going to get into the Rota, too. Damn it. Damn it. Damn it, you bell! Like, 
any other form, any other form, I wouldn't care. Not first form. First form is the worst form where you fail to draw. Because if I don't got Dark Griffin, then I'm fucked. You know, if it was Terra, I could at least go, okay, well, send you, you bell, you know, send you bell, uh, first form. And then I have message in a bottle, I get my three levels, message in a bottle, send everybody back, still get my normal summon, all I have to do is exceed. Huh? You can only special summon one cannon in this, this way listed on this effect once per turn. You can't do that. You freaking cheated. You read your effects, fool. Well, Only one. You gonna exceed? Yep. I took the 214. Okay, well, he normal summoned that, so. Okay, sure. Ugh. Well, thanks for the limit reverse, it's just I have you bell in my hand! Uh. Oh my god. Oh my god, I swear to god. Like, come on. Like, please, why? What? No. Like,. Why, uh, my kingdom for a dark graffer, uh, I have low eater, I guess I'll go ahead and send, don't need level 4, so I guess I'll go ahead and send longhorn. Mm, come on, very upsetting. I got three different levels, so that's good. I, you know, there's a ton of cards that I would love to get in my hand, but probably not. No, it's not even worth setting right now. Like, fuck, come on. Please, Dak, cooperate with me. Please. I'm doing my plays, I'm ready to go, but why? Why make me draw you bell? There's no fucking reason why I have to draw you bell. But thank you. Thank you. Mm-hmm. I'm literally gonna get beat by these fucking divas because my hand is so shitty. Like, come on. XC? That's fine. Who are you XCing into? Castell. You wanna put it back in my deck? Or you wanna set me? Okay, yeah, that, yep, so I get shit hand, you get Christy, that sounded alright, sounds cool, thanks, thanks for that, I have no way of getting around Christy, uh, I hate luck. Oh, you got it, I got nothing, I got nothing to beat Christy. Ah, <sighs> of course. Oh, I got exactly four, Christia. Oh, look at me, I'm so lucky. Well, how are you? Oh, my hand is just ass. I drew you, Bell. First form, I, I probably could have had some pretty decent plays if I didn't draw first from you, Bell. Ah, uh, fuck my life. I get on here every damn day and try to do it. It's the same shit. Over and over and over again. You too! Alright, well this hand's not bad. I 
You're going first. Take your turn. Come on. Take your turn. Get my C plays on. I haven't been able to do shit. Okay. That's great. So it's clearly means that I'm definitely, most definitely, most definitely gonna get fucking, uh, my ass beat by dinosaurs. So that's good. It's my favorite, my favorite pastime, getting my ass beat by dinosaurs. He's most definitely just gonna summon another level 4 dinosaur next turn because I can't kill this fucker this turn. And he's gonna fucking make a Logiar Doka. So, yep, that's fun. Going against dinosaurs is fun. God, just uh, I hate DM. Go get some deck where I might have a decent chance of dueling and get a shitty hand. Go up and get, and get a good hand, but go against a deck that's clearly gonna be just whooping my ass. So, it's gonna be fun. Go ahead, go. Summon level four. Logia Doka. Logia Doka. Alright. I have enough of my fucking dueling fucking decks that make Logia and Doka. Oh. 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 Okay. Sure. I guess. You'd have a level four to go into Logia or Doka? Yeah, I would have one motherfucker who rips shit out of my graveyard and vanishes my shit, right? No, oh, okay. Wow, that is a really, really, really shitty fucking monster. I swear to God, it is. Like, that's all you do? No. All that for each drag monster in the graveyard. He's 25. I guess that's what I get for listening to you. Alright, you bell time. Draw. Sure. That would have been pretty. Never mind, it wouldn't have. Alright, let's go ahead and summon terror. There we go. Uh. I only have 10 and 4 right now, so I got a lot of the walking 10 level either, so that'd be another level. Got a little bit more setup to do, so I'll take a little bit longer. So, end phase effect. Let me go ahead and, and copy and paste that for you. Yep, you already know it. Go ahead. So, unless you make a freaking doka, but I'm gonna rip off both of them attachments. I'm not gonna allow you to flip. Definitely not. No flips. Fuck flipping. You gonna try to flip, you can go flip yourself. Oh, God, I wish you would get your errata already. I swear to God, just get your errata. If you had your errata, I could go into you. That's probably the reason why I put them in here, because of the errata, but nope, didn't get the errata yet. So, I guess I'm not doing that anytime soon. Damn it. Am I only level 3 as a tuner? Damn it. I think I could like summon you, send you, send the level 3, you know. Yes. What about it? Yes. <sighs> There'd be no point in even running limit reverse if it didn't do that. Limit reverse is the best you bell summoner. Uh that's during my end phase, but whatever. Just okay, you're just gonna quit. You're just gonna quit. Good job. Thank you. Why was I going to draw next? Really? Foolish. 
So maybe I should run like a level 3. I could summon back with the Breeze Dragon. The level Eater. So I could go eat a level off of Terror. Go to well, the Breeze, summon back the level 3. The Breeze, I mean, level Eater, eat a level off of Terror, summon, make it to start us. Maybe. I'll edit that and fix that because seriously, Gale ain't doing shit right now. Yep. Alright, and then maybe that'll open up some more room for the extra deck. So, yeah. I'll go work on that. I got other videos to record. Alright, so, despite that, I hope that you guys enjoyed this episode of I'm and Why. So, thanks for watching. Thanks for all the support. And I will see you guys tomorrow using Cosmic U Bell. Thanks for watching.